Not many players have what I would call a signature play. Jeter had the jump across the diamond. You know, you got this play up the middle that I think is one of the sweetest plays in all baseball. I want to ask you about it. Is that all right? Yes, sir. Let's do it. First of all, when did you start making that play? I would say my first year, I made that play, but I used to jump and throw the ball. Then I realized, you know, you get more mature, you get more experience, now you get to know who's running. So Plus you got this cannon rocket well, arm. It's okay. <laughs> so, you know, I realized that I can throw under. So it was easier for me instead of jumping, just get rid of it right away. Especially when you get guys like um, fast runner. For me, that's the first thing I want to do, just get rid of it right away and be able to just get rid of the ball and throw it to the bag and see what happens. All right, so let's go through some of the footwork. There's somebody sitting at home right now going, what are they talking about? So I'm talking about this backhand play where you field it, he comes back and throws it this way. So take me through. The ball's being hit. What are you doing as it's coming your way? Well, the first thing you do is just timing. You want you wants to be able, you don't want to just run it and be able to just, you know, you want to time it where you can just one step and just get rid of it right away. Especially, like, I want to be, when I cut it, I want to be right on my right foot. So that way I can cut it and then just, boom, get rid of it. At, at what point do you know uh, you're not going to outrun the ball and end up in a position here where you can actually circle it? Exactly. When do you know it's going to be a ball you got to reach for? Well, I would say that's what I said. You, you time it while it's past the pitcher because you react right away, right? Once you react, you know, especially like when you play the game, three or four years in the league. If you know who's running, you got a chance to time the ball or you got to just go, you know, run through it, drive it, and then just get rid of it. That's like a 3-0 fastball, and you're sitting there well, going, I got it, my it, pitch. It's look like a 3-0 fastball. <laughs> and then, I mean, the ball's hit, and you got to be like, oh, yeah, this is it. This is it. You get that reaction? Yeah, you get that, yeah, of course, right away. You, especially like when you know who's hitting. Let's say, for example, Kinsler. Okay. You know, I made that play against Kinsler, so... He's the guy that use more middle left field. Right. So he's the guy that you're gonna play kind of middle, right behind, close to the back. So if you play him close to the back, so you get a chance that any ball, you, but you know he's fast. So you gotta get rid of it. So for me, I always set in my mind, because I know who's hitting, who has a chance to hit it that way. If he's a, a slow runner, so what I'm going to do, I'm just going to get grab the ball, make sure that I grab the ball, and then just get rid of it. But if but it's if a fast runner, like he's got to grab it. Yeah, Kinsley, you got to get rid of it right away. Okay, let me roll a couple to you. All right, let's see how this works. And then we'll uh, get on out of here. Okay, where do you want me to throw it? <laughs> no, you know, yeah, you can chuck it. Nobody's going to get hurt. So he's coming right here. I got it right here, and then boom. You know, like a lot of guys, they love to jump. But once you jump, you're losing. Because the guys that hit the ball, he's running right away. So he's not stopping. When you grab and then you're trying to jump, you lose time, you give a guy the chance to be safe. So you feel like you're gaining maybe two steps by getting rid of it I would quick. say one. One step? If I take two, that would be too much. Yeah. That's why I just caught it, boom, one, and then get rid of it right away. But you're, you're cutting down, the runner the is runner, going. Yes. If you jump, he's got another one, maybe two, two maybe yeah, three steps. Yeah, exactly. Before you've gotten rid of it. It's like the same thing you get a ground ball. A lot of guys like to just pop the glove twice, give them guys a chance. You gave me maybe one or two steps, and that's not what you want. So for me, I know that I'm running away from the back, so I got to get rid of it right away. All right, last one, full motion. You can throw it across their heads. Watch out, cameraman. Here we go. All right, so here's the play. So you want me to throw it now? Yeah, go ahead. Throw it. Let me see what you got. Oh, you got it, too. That's it. That's so sweet, man. I love that. It's one of my favorite right, plays in baseball. All Thank right. you. Robinson Cano. I know. I hope you learned something. I sure did. See ya.